We're back. All right. Welcome back. Anyway. <laughs> Gotta love how that works, right? Yeah, it's all good. No worries. What would you trade it for? Instead. Is there something you're looking for? Because he has so much stuff. My only issue with doing this, I legitimately have no idea what I would ask for. The only no change I would want to make I could use some potions that I don't really <clears throat> want. And instead of more damage, I would like per encounter to change the type of damage instead of per day. Hmm. It's like short rest, maybe? No, per encounter. Anytime that we don't use initiative, in which you can change it. Anytime we don't use initiative, in between, I want to be able to change the type of damage. Like I for do. short rest instead of for long rest. Right. <laughs> but I mean, because I can already I call it's any it's type of elemental <laughs> damage. So I can call you know fire, ice, <laughs> poison. I guess is <coughs> the other one in that case. But I don't want to do it per. I don't want to have a three charge set on my back. I want per encounter. Hmm. I see. That is a very powerful enchantment. <coughs> for it's a pretty sweet crown and scepter. For these items. <laughs> for a sandwich. <laughs> and. And a sandwich. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Twenty thousand gold. I can do that. What's twenty thousand in platinum? Two hundred. Yeah. Mm. <coughs> Actually, Ren does know something Deal. he wants. And uh, how long will? Is that take? I don't care. I'm just curious. Uh, that would take a couple of days. We good? Mm -hmm. We good? You said two hundred platinum. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Done. Have to wait. We're well, gonna have to come back for it. Well, yeah, that would take a few days. <coughs> so you have a few days to be. kill in Sartek City. Okay, but Rand also specifically because he. If he hadn't done it, Rand would have noticed it, but he comes up to Sven afterwards. He's like, that um, that uh, eyepiece you just used could you like just the number of attacks or just would there be something like that you could use as maybe a sight on a weapon? And he like just gestures to his crossbow on his back. Uh, also with the sandwich, can I have that as a turkey with uh, provolone? I'm being told to pick the flavor. Like a seen gem sight. <coughs> that sounds disgusting. Or, huh? <coughs> or that would do like a scope. It just that would give you true sight. Roll yeah, or even minutes. if like roll not roll even if it wasn't minutes. true true sight, like just like maybe have to focus through it for an action or something out of character, but and, give and you see invisibility if there's something invisible near me. Or I have seen a similar item like this um, <coughs> in it, it is on a sniper rifle uh, that I have tweaked for a gunslinger um, I'm simply interested in the scope part of it I've, I, could, I have I no could clue about rifles I could craft this thing for you uh, it'll we, essentially how it works is it would have Three charges per long rest that would give you advantage. Okay. On a given attack roll made with said crossbow. Okay. Okay. This is exactly what I would. Yes, Sven, if you could craft this for me, I would be very, very happy. How but much would that you. That will uh, take a little bit uh, longer, probably uh, maybe two weeks. And would cost. I can use some of the gems from the crown. Uh, 10,000 gold? 
10,000, so that's 100 platinum pretty much. Yes. I've got that. I, I just pay that up front, and I even toss in, okay. like, an extra two platinum just for shits and giggles. Being like, you've been, always been good to us, Finn. There you go. It has been a great day for me. <laughs> <laughs> sure has. <clears throat> Much work to do. Go. Um... <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. See if I want to do anything, fine. Okay. Oh. Oh, you said you couldn't think of anything. I was either. trying to figure it out, and he helped me think of something. Uh, okay. <laughs> what would you like? I want to be able to do two attacks. Everybody else can. Uh, you, yeah, need a, you need a. You need a repeat. You don't use a crossbow. Uh, you use a regular. I bow. use a regular bow. Yeah. I see. So. So you might have a ring or something that would take care of the problem. Yeah, but I can't attune anything. Maybe. Two items. Maybe. I got the the gloves, <laughs> the bow. Um. I don't have an attuned bow. Oh. I have um the gloves, the I have the gloves, a ring of protection, and an amulet of health. Right. Maybe <clears throat> you could get the uh I don't remember what it's called, but where the arrow notches a thing that notches more than one arrow. Hmm. For a multi attack kind of thing. Mm, interesting. Um It would probably be like one attack roll and Double damage dice. Have to take dice. a full round action like I do with my crossbow, maybe. Well, he's a rogue. He gets one attack. Well, so do I. I'm a rogue. Yeah. That's the thing. I have to yeah. use my entire round. Uh, yeah. Let's see. So you would basically you wouldn't be able to attack two well, creatures, but you could do two attacks against one creature. And obviously, like the reasoning behind that is the sneak attack damage. Right. Oh, exactly. Yeah. Substantial for the one. We're not. Balanced uh, around being able to make two attacks. I know. Granted, you don't get sneak attack per on, like, right. on multiple attacks. Same way. Uh, because it is possible. <coughs> but you yeah. get advantage now. <sighs> but you only get. Sorry, what? <laughs> you'll get advantage now. Uh, <laughs> it literally, like as I was saying this, it just spontaneously started. Sort of I don't going. even need to hide or do anything to get a sneak attack damage with that new scope. Do you have sneak attack if you have advantage on the roll? As long as I have advantage, I get sneak attack. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> that's why our, uh, that's why our that's new ability with the works. mage hand is it's amazing. Gonna be OP. Yeah. Gonna be well, we have to be within tap, thirty tap. feet. But still, y'all, I only get it once around, no matter what I do. So. Yeah. <clears throat> that's the big advantage of the whole sneak attack thing too. He pulls out this. Uh, Like from from behind his uh, counter, right? Mm -hmm. Pulls out this bowstring. Says, "I have uh, I've been working on this sort of thing, and uh, to make it faster, you know, shooting. Um, this bowstring will allow you to shoot. It's a bonus action again. Three, three is a good, nice number there. Uh, three times per long rest. Uh, allow you to make to to shoot two arrows, essentially. Uh, with your attack action. With your attack action. Yeah. So and hasted unlike string. the repeating crossbow, it's not the full, like it's just a regular attack action. So it kind of gives you a little burst of speed <coughs> for shooting purposes. The hasted bowstring? You legolas. <laughs> a little bit, yeah. Yeah. So basically that would let me double my damage for three times per long rest. Not double it, obviously, because you don't get sneak attack for every hit. Oh, yeah. I know, but I just mean like as far as I would yeah. still roll the same number of sneak attack dice to double the regular damage. Right. Okay. Essentially. Or roll two uh, dice for regular damage. Right. If you hit both, yeah. Obviously. Um <coughs> so that would and uh you could because it has it's three charges for long rest, right? So theoretically speaking, you could use all three charges on a on one turn and shoot. Four. four arrows. Jesus Christ, that's some that, like that men in tight shit. really awesome. Right, yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, that's a reference for you. Robin Hood, <laughs> men in tight. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Women in tights, tight, tight. <clears throat> it too would be men, men. Uh, 
ten thousand gold. Or one hundred platinum, whichever one you prefer. True. I think do I have anything that we, I mean I can haggle the prize, I'm sure, but I don't have anything with the border. Do you need something do you need something there, Kyron? No, I'm good, thank you. <laughs> Haggling's not the issue. I can haggle. Well, no. Rand was... But Rand has money. I know. Okay. Yeah. Rand, I'll call in the favor when I actually need it. Okay. <laughs> <coughs> so, 10,000, you say? Yes. It is experimental. Experimental. It works. It's been tested. That's so fine. It's I, not I'm, untested. I'm not questioning your craft. <laughs> you won't die. It'll be fine. <laughs> It'll be okay. You see the red button? Don't push red button. Don't push red button. Except on bark. Bark. Push red button on bark. He knows it is fine. Yeah, that's funny. Trust the fluff. First rule of dungeons. Oh, I love flumps. Flumps? Flumps. Yes, flumps. Yeah, they're weird. <laughs> I just... I was looking through the wild very, sorcery table and it's very like... very tentacly. Summon 1d6 flumps controlled by the DM. <coughs> yeah, flumps. They're really um, derpy. I love in uh, Order of the Stick, there was a reoccurring joke that every time someone fell from a really big height, they landed on a... On a these just yeah. two flumps that kept yes. being around. <laughs> that escaped oh. from the very first dungeon at the beginning of the yep. comic. Yep, yep. I haven't checked so up on that good. in like months. What? Stick of Truth or what? Order, order of the Stick, a webcomic. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, it hasn't. He hasn't been working on them. I know that he oh. goes long periods of time <laughs> without updating. I haven't liked it either. It's so good. It is. No. Oh. Alex, your student's crushing again. Quit that. Um. I want to haggle. That's the thing. Well, haggle then. Okay. 8,000 gold. <laughs> I know, right? Give it's a, a terrible haggle, but... Give me a persuasion check. That's the thing. <clears throat> How do numbers work? 25. 25. Persuasion check? Persuasion check. Wouldn't, yeah. <clears throat> to reduce it by how much? 2,000 gold. Okay. Considering we've given him so much gold already today. <laughs> including some very useful items. 9,000. Deal. <laughs> I'll do 9,000. <laughs> you, you took some off. Great. I did. I saved myself something. How many platinum is that? Did everyone else stop watching? 90. No, there's still the same amount of viewers. Well, that means that some did watch top. Cool. <coughs> so now Here we go. I have a bowstring of double attack. A tasted bowstring. Yeah. yeah. Where the hell do I write that at? You could call it a tasted bowstring or <coughs> bowstring of quickness. You got a bow uh, string to allow him to three times a day attack an additional time. Uh, like it's just shoot an extra arrow. Shoot an yeah. extra arrow. He could use all three on one turn if he wanted. So you attack four times. All yeah. Three? Yeah. Cool. If I so desired. Yep. Yeah. Okay. I think we've all got something now. <laughs> yeah. Very good. I have much work to do. Two weeks. <coughs> like in two weeks, we'll be back. So we just gonna wait around for two weeks. So two weeks in Sartak City, you have a, any number of different things you can do. Yeah. Uh, there are. Rand hasn't played cards in a while. Say, Rand's probably gonna gamble. I'm probably okay. gonna go to the He's library. He's not going to cheat though. He is very worried about getting hurt again. He's just going to play cards. <clears throat> do you want to play the dice game or just cards? The dice game. No, just cards. Six like. tools. Okay. <laughs> Goldfish. So, just in general, nothing special. I'm not even trying to earn money. He's just going to be constantly just 
sitting around playing cards. He's got so much money that he doesn't even care how much he's losing or winning. He just yeah. is playing in the taverns. There and is. you're playing at like the lower level, so you're like yeah, I'm you've like, been translating some out to coppers and silver. So you like can, silver is like a the big I'm, money. Silver's the I'm at a tavern where silver is the current betting currency. Okay, I gotcha. Uh, <laughs> well, there is of course the card game. Yeah. That you would roll essentially serendipity type dice on, or uh, there's a dice game where you roll two d six. It's and you're trying to get seven or eleven. Eleven. So craps. And you can double down to get a reroll, yeah. or to get another die roll that you add to the total. I'm not really trying to make a big thing of it, so I'm just going to do play okay, cards cool. and serendipity. Forty six. <laughs> Okay. Uh, you didn't do very well, but you didn't do super poorly, right? Right. So, so I would say you probably lost about five gold. Negligible amount of money, yeah. Which yeah, when to you, you guys it is negligible, negligible, yeah. But to them, it's uh, like, them, hey, this guy is like, I probably got a couple drinks bought for me. Yeah. It's like, you know. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> I'm going to assume in this town there is a bard. That's playing a little concert out in the out in the town. We're in Star Trek City, right? And, um, yeah, yeah there there's are, definitely there's a bar. Oh, definitely, somewhere. I know. I'm just stating obvious stuff. Yeah, yes. there's a bar that owns a sexy badger somewhere here. True, there is. I forgot about that. I like to pickpocket the crowd. Oh. Various people. I did okay. lose a substantial amount of money today. Fair enough. Uh, hmm. How much time are you going to spend doing this? How much time do we got? <laughs> In what district? <laughs> Technically speaking, two weeks. True. So you're going to spend two weeks perusing the city and pockets? I think I'll spend a week perusing the city, getting as much money as I can. And then the week after that, I'm going to spend tinkering more. Just, just cut pursing. And... Okay. A uh, couple questions uh -huh. about that. Um, are you doing it in, like, rich districts? The Middle class districts, poor mm. districts, like what's the? No, uh, probably in the middle area. Middle area. Okay, yeah. got it. Nothing like too high end because that's going to cause too much suspicion, but nothing too low because I'm not going to get that much. Got it. Uh, so give me, we'll say four pickpocket rolls. Okay. Slide of hand. Slide of hand. That you have a shit ton of bonus on. Oh yeah, I forgot. <laughs> I'm about to say the minimum I can roll is thirty. <laughs> right. Well, There's, roll them anyway, just to see. You might get some ones. No, that doesn't you matter. Can't. matter. He's a rogue. Roll a nat one. He's a rogue. You can't roll a nat one on you a can't, you ability can't crit check. Fail uh, or critical success. Usually a, we we did not that. anymore. We have stopped that apparently. We have no. we have in the past. Okay. Uh, technically, but it's only not. during like so specific situations. You said four of them. Yes. You want to use any of these? I got them. pink ones. Ah, everything is falling apart. 17. Well, there's a 17 there, plus 20, so 37. Nice. 31, 30. Okay, <laughs> got it. I would say, even in the kind of middle area, um, over the course of a week, you make about... Because you're just, like stealing a lot throughout the day. <laughs> it goes like flip, flip, flip. <laughs> yeah. Um, you make about a thousand gold. Nice. Uh, and the guards in the district triple. <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't go back to that district for a little bit. Yeah, you do. And That's why I'm going to spend the last week in my room studying. <laughs> I'm not even going to bother rolling. To like perception checks and that kind of thing. You can't get a thirty with a normal guard. <laughs> most normal guards don't have that high of perception. <laughs> check. It's, fucking it's, it's, like, <laughs> yeah, right. it's like plus seven kind of shit. Yeah, uh, and they need a plus. Um, I feel like I feel like I'm a high level character in Skyrim, just yeah. crouching behind people. Yeah. <laughs> you start to like um, about four days in. It becomes a little bit more difficult because, like, some newspaper articles and stuff come out about, you know, district-wide theft. Uh, I pick up a paper. I but, can't believe this stuff's going on in this town. What's but, that? Where's our guards? 
criminals. But your roles know, are, right? are stupid. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, you, <coughs> you still. You're fine. You still make out. <laughs> oh yeah. Very very well. I'm okay with that. Um, Carlos. Yeah, that's the uh, name of the bard she has. Oh. He's Mexican, it's okay. Um, so then you're going to go tinker and stuff, right? Yeah, I'm just going to study my tinkering stuff. Okay. For a second, wait, okay. More. Anyone else doing any... Your... I like to call your... Yeah. Um, Alchemist Fire Whiskey. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Congratulations. And playing cards. Yeah, I don't even have to buy my own drinks for most stuff. of it. I'm bored from stuff. that. You wanted to go talk to them. That was a while back, though. Well, yeah, you got time. Mm-hmm. You haven't done that yet. Yeah. We, we have a role they, they needed done. They kind of did do a thing with me. Ah, <coughs> yes. And you, you <coughs> don't want to know you're about to go over to said place. You go and meet with uh, Kagan. He's the leader of Penumbra. Kagoon. Um. Soren, you're back already. Mm-hmm. Uh, any news? Well, brought someone back from the dead. That's fun. <laughs> oh, nuns. Uh, Rand? Yeah. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Somehow he knows about me. <laughs> was there for oh. a while. <laughs> you're still going to the Underdark? Or Eventually. Where to next? Uh, where was it? Was that? Room or room or that? <laughs> I'm not even gonna try. If you wanna what? <laughs> uh, <laughs> hmm. Candy kind of pulls out this enormous letter <coughs> uh, that has all these tabs in it. Windows open. <laughs> yeah. uh, it's got a lot it's of got windows a lot of tabs, open. Tabs, a yeah, windows open. that's right. It does, and uh, you can see a lot of different places, like location names, are on the tabs. Even the one to uh, Ifuwama. And uh, where are you go? Like, is that your your primary stop? You're going there because of the teleportation Pearl. circle. I assume right. Uh, for, the, the Pearl thing still? for the Pearl thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and actually, and I didn't you, even doubt it was something they did. So you were explained that there's an, another city we'll be teleporting to. I don't know if that's Ifuwama or the other one. Well, Ifuwama is where you're going to first. You're going okay. to Mako. So we're Eventually, teleporting to with Wawa to we're, get to a mock we're, we're, we're going to go after the other part. These are the part. Okay. In Ah, uh, yes, with the overgrowth. And the uh, giants. Yep. Right. Yes. Okay. <coughs> um... The leader of Imako has been through his corruption uh, siphoning funds and that's no good. Okay. So we have sent warnings. Leader of place funds stealing. Okay. Yes. I'm not even gonna try to say the name of it. Um, if you are. This is an Ibaco. Oh, that is. Because he looks at he kind of looks over uh, both yeah, places. Like a dumbass, right? <laughs> um, <laughs> if you want is a cool word to say. <coughs> it is. If you want to be my lover. Oh. God damn it. <laughs> One year ago today. Right. Huh. 
We've sent him have, several have warnings trimmed it since to cease. Yeah. Yeah. Ichi Mama. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, he has not. He has continued. So he's got to be taken out. Okay. Okay. To the fishes. <clears throat> Just think it was like, you know, we, we sit at a bar somewhere and he slides a piece of paper across the table and that you think happens here? We should this time this shit rolls. I don't know. Uh, I don't know from Penumbra. You say, will, of course, I, be I paid accordingly. I, uh, I, I assume you'll have help. <laughs> we'll see. It's out of time time. Out of time time. We will be right back. Later. Uh, 